Bangalore has been a major center for sports in the country and a home for several outstanding sports persons in various disciplines like cricket, athletics, tennis, hockey, football, basketball and table tennis besides other games. Now we have a new star in the making in shooting and she is the 14 year old Tilottama Sen. A school girl who took up shooting two years ago and excelling in the sport ever since. She has won the medals in state and national meets and she participated in the world junior champ. She has been selected for the world championship due to be held in October. She is ranked 43 in the world in her category. She has won medals in state and national meets and she participated in the world junior championship few months ago. In this video, Tilottama Sen speaks about her career in shooting. Um, shooting, I never knew about shooting. So in the lockdown, my dad came and told me, do you want to start shooting? I said, yeah, sure. I want to try shooting. Yeah. And yeah, that's how I started. It's been two years I've started shooting. Yeah. And uh, who has been, where do you train and who is your coach? Uh, I started training near, there was a range uh, very near to my ho home, Electronic yeah. City, there I started. Yeah. And then after a few months, I joined Elite and I've worked with a lot of coaches yeah. from there. And yeah. What are the events you normally participate? Is I'm just doing a 10 meter right now. Rifle shooting, yes, is it? Yes, 10 yeah. meter air rifle. Yeah. Yeah, that's my main event now. Uh, no, no, pistol you are not? No, not pistol. Yeah. Only rifle, air rifle. Oh, yeah. air rifle only pistol. Yeah. How many tournaments you have participated uh, uh, at the national, I just state played, and international yeah. levels? I just played my first national uh, and yeah. this is going to be my second international. My first international was the Junior World Cup in yeah. Germany yeah. and this will be my when second. When was this? Uh, this was uh, two, three months back. Yeah. Yeah, and now uh, it's going to be my world championship. Oh, yes. What it's are the Kailu. dates for the world championship? Uh, it's starting from 15th to 23rd. Yeah. Uh, the dates aren't fixed now. Yeah. Uh, my match dates, but yeah. between 15th to 23rd. You October. are participating in the women's section or the yeah, yeah. junior junior girls section? Junior, junior, junior. Uh, yes. Sure. Right. What has been your uh, major achievements in sport as of now? Uh, as of now, uh, I told <laughs> I'm very new to this sport, so yeah. uh, I have uh, medals in the national yeah. uh, event and nationals and yeah, yeah. What about internationals you yet to go, <laughs> the medals yet to come. Uh, what about national games? You know, you have been national games uh, is in this month, 28th, yeah. it's starting, so yeah. yeah. Uh, what are the future events I mean lined up for you? Uh, so it's national games, then World Cup, then yeah. after two three months we have a Asian Egan Championship, yeah. and then it's going to be again nationals. Okay. Yes. And you know, you, uh, as an youngster, mm -hmm. uh, what kind of support you get from your senior colleagues? No? Uh. Till now, I did not get any support. Like I obviously ask them for their experiences. Okay. They do share their experience. Yeah. But support yet. <laughs> okay. Yeah, right. What about your? Uh, obviously, parents must be supporting in a very yes, big way. Yes. Yes. So, what is their contribution? Uh, in lockdown, like my dad has spent most of his time with me, like the travel part. Yeah. And yeah. Now my mom and dad both travel with me every day for my training. Yeah. Yeah. So they are very supporting. What do you think is the uh, most difficult part of your sport shooting? Um, this is a mental sport, though. Yeah. I think being mentally very strong is very important in the sport. So that's also the difficult part. Yeah. yeah. Do you undergo any training for mental strengthening, like the uh, still now sports no. Sports psychologist. Sports psychologist, no, not. I didn't start yet. Uh -huh. I have to. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. And uh, what are the other sports 
or interested in your field? Um, I used to play volleyball and throw ball, but after lockdown, I stopped doing volleyball and throw ball. It's just shooting now. Yeah. It has been mentioned that now you are doing some karate do and all that. I used to do karate, uh -huh. but now I don't. I stopped doing it after lockdown. That is okay. See, uh, in the sport, do you have any idol? I mean, whom, uh, yeah, it's uh, there are many uh, like. Abhinav Bindra, yeah. Gagan Narang, yeah. and many more. <laughs> and you have seen a lot of uh, shooters. You know, we already participated in international events. Mm. And uh, what do you see the difference between our shooters and their shooters in Western? I don't see any difference. Like both. Yeah. Your Indian team shooters and the international shooters are very strong competitive. So okay. I don't find any differences. And uh, what do you? Uh, what about the equipment? I mean, are you uh, able to get a good equipment in India? For the yes. Shooting? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is it an important thing or are you? Uh, no, uh, they make it here okay. in India. Okay. Yes. So how many hours do you train for any major championship? Um, I usually train six, seven hours, six to seven hours every day. Uh -huh. Is it a target shooting your practice or what? Uh, how is it like? Uh, yeah, we have a target. We uh -huh. shoot. Okay. See, uh, how long you want to carry on in the sports and uh, what is your goals? Well, the goal is obviously the Olympics. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm trying for the Olympic 2024. Let's see. 2024. Yes.